Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to teach you how to use the CL or how to display messages. So let's assume that we have started the project. Make sure the first line we have the header file include IO stream, input output stream file. And then we're using namespace standard in main with the open bracket, curly bracket, and close. And before closing the curly bracket, we have a return zero with semicolon. So when we want to display any message, we use the command or C out. C out represents command for output. And then we have to add another two less than symbols with the message. If I want to display a hello world message, then I have to put the message in a double quote. And at last, don't forget about a semicolon. So the semicolon will tell the compiler that this is the end of uh, one line. Okay. Now, after we have this, we can try to compile and run. Press the F5 button. It will show the words hello world. So basically, you can print any or you can display any message using the C out syntax. For an example, if I copy and paste all of the hello words and paste it in three lines, compile and run it using the F5 key, you will find that you print three types of hello words, hello word, and hello words. So it is possible also for us to rearrange the message so we print line by line. Let's try. So there are two ways of doing that. One is include another double, less than symbols, and continue with NL. E and the L before the semicolon. Okay, so now let's compile and run again. You will get three lines of hello words. If you don't want to use the E and the L, we may have backslash A symbol, a space with black dash blank blanks, backslash N. Compile and run, you will get three lines. You also can print multiple messages together. Let's say this is your first message that you want to print, and then you want to continue another message. So it's okay, just type double, less than symbol, and then the second message you want to print. Hello world, and then my name is full stop. So if you want to combine them in one line, just remove one of the backslash n. Okay. Now let's press the F5, compile and run again. So it shows, hello words, my name is CKO. If you need one more space over here, then you have to adjust in your coding part to include one space. So that when you display, there is a space before the my name is CKO. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and let's try to do it using C out double less than symbol. Thank you for watching this video.